Hello, this is Hakka the Bean, and today we are going to be reading level 98 of the Back Rooms. Here's a fun little thing. I haven't been doing the Back Rooms at all in, like, forever. All because I read a level a long time ago, and then I suddenly got an email saying that apparently the video got removed, checked it on the channel, and it was still there. I deleted it because I got a little bit paranoid, and now I'm not sure if this is a good idea. I'm gonna try it and see what happens. Anyway, if you like this video, please like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get right into this. Survival Difficulty Class 1. This level is safe, secure, and has a minimal NC count. Level 98 is the 99th level of the backrooms. Description. The first area of level 98 is a small repeating section of a straight building line street with a brick road. The level loops, however, the wanderer also appears to repeat with it. For example, if you sit in the middle of the road and look straight ahead, you will be able to see many copies of yourself, which will be at the same time as you. Almost none of the buildings on the street can be opened except for the buildings you enter or out of and a single diner in the middle of the section of the street. This diner is the only source of light on the street besides what appears to be the moon in the sky. On the outside of the diner is a large yellow lit sign with the text Downtown Diner, displayed in black text. On the inside, slightly familiar music can be heard playing. The smell of breakfast food being cooked across uh, uh, through the room from the kitchen. And the sound of clanking pots, pans, and silverware can be heard from the kitchen. No fate as you get near and see that there is nobody in the kitchen. Sitting in down in one of the diner seats has a chance of summoning a few entities. These entities appear to be people all familiar to the wanderer in question, that their faces are unable to be seen, instead looking out of focus, much like a camera. Any times to stand up and move towards the entities will make the lights blink off in the diner, and when the lights return, they will have vanished. Any words the entities say will be garbled, as if far away or talked over. Basis, outposts, and communities. Diner patrons. They have multiple wanderers who have chosen not to leave the diner. They are friendly and welcome anyone who enters the diner. Amount of patrons vary as some decide to leave eventually. All seem to be close friends with each other. Entrances and exits. Entrances. There are only two ways to enter the diner. One, you can find a metal door that matches the door you enter the floor out of on level 5 and level 11. Then the door locks behind you, or you could wander level 6 long enough until you eventually walk out of an alley a footer down on, and on the street. You can also enter from the hub, which will lead out the same door as levels 5 and 11. Exits. You could leave to level 6 through an alley at the far end of the street, or leave to the door you came in from before it closes. You can also walk into the bathrooms in the diner, which will lead to level 103. Well, that was a very short level. Seems to be an interesting diner. Anyway, if you like this video, and if it doesn't get like... I think false flag is what happened last time. But if you like this video... Oh, oh, please like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, so until then, goodbye!